Welcome to the World Wide Web. Hey, it's the first time we're doing this here streaming live election coverage on primary night 2020 on June the 7th. I'm Dave Price. Thanks for being with us. Jerry Crawford, Mike Mahaffey, our insiders from a couple of years, a couple of cycles <laughs> uh, that they've uh, been following this year. Uh, a lot of things to watch here, right? We have way more information than I would have expected. Okay. Uh, with uh, with about 7,000 votes counted in Polk County, Mary Wells, the appointed interim county treasurer, uh, is at 70 Seven percent. There's what you're talking about in that uh, Senate race, District 17. There we can see those numbers. Isaiah Knox uh, up comfortably. Isaiah Knox is going to be a very impressive young state senator. Our Todd Simmons has been checking with elections officials uh, throughout the afternoon and throughout the evening. Todd, what do you have so far? It has been a busy, busy day for Alexis offices across Iowa. Right now, I am at, let's see if I can get this here, the election office here in Polk County, where, as you mentioned, largest county in the state. So a lot of ballots to count, a lot of ballots, uh, just a lot of ballots. That is the uh, theme of tonight, Dave. Okay, Taj, thanks. Back out to this uh, U.S. Senate race. So you have Mike Frank and Abby Finkenauer, Dr. Glenn um, Hearst here. It looks to me as if uh, Michael Franken is going to win uh, fairly decisively in the uh, Senate race. And, and that would be something. Save a few of these thoughts for TV, will you? Okay. <laughs> we're we're going we're gonna to wrap up our coverage online here as we take another uh, deep dive into the numbers. Mike Franken looking like he may be on his way to win that U.S. Senate Democratic primary.